Tonight on the Friday free game feature, we have Merry Gear Solid 2. Well, Snake, it's been a while since anyone's had a truly Merry Christmas. What with the sudden surge of PNCs popping up around the world. PNCs? Pretty naughty children. Naughty doesn't even begin. <laughs> Pretty naughty right. children. They're more like... Hired mercenaries selling their services to the highest bidder. That's pretty naughty. It used to be just a few rogue groups, but now it's become a global phenomenon. Look, I'll let you decide for yourself. Would you rather be called Old Snake or Cold Snake? Cold Snake. Cold Snake. Yes. Good. Hold it, Snake. It's foolish to run headfirst into every situation. By holding the shift key near a wall, you can hug up against it. Doing so will allow you to get a better view of what's up ahead. Can I hold the shift key near a kid? No, Snake. Stranger danger. Knock, knock. Oh, what was that noise? Nerd. You're supposed to say who's there. That is my imagination. <laughs> Maybe we can lure him. We're luring children, guys. Oh. Snake, you're surrounded. Use the deer head to sneak your way out of there. <laughs> Amazing. A oh, crap. He's over here. Got us. It doesn't notice the deer head that magically appeared on the wall. It's good. But don't come all the way down. Oh, that's close. No closer, kid. Woo! Nothing here but the deer. End cane. Otacon, what the hell am I supposed to do with a candy cane? That's no ordinary candy cane. Read the wrapper. Novocaine? So you're telling me I could put a kid to sleep with this thing? That's right. One last thing. What is it? Candy canes go... in the mouth, not through the windpipe. You got that? Oh, where was that... Where did that kid come from? Snake? Snake! There wasn't a kid there before. Jerks. Like this. It's close. What was that? Who's that? Ooh. You didn't see anything. It looks like a trap. Phrase. I am the ghost of Christmas present. And delivering milk is my fortified forte. Look, Snake, we've got to hurry before the situation gets real <laughs> sour. <laughs> I've got it! I know how to defeat him! But are you sure you want me to, uh, <laughs> spoil it? Try setting the clock on your computer ahead a week or two. All right, we're going to actually try that. <laughs> That's what I call a blood-curdling scream. <laughs> that special blue fox sneaking suit. You must be Python's kid. Please, Snake. Father had a name. Frosty Frost. Frosty Frost. And that would make you... Jack, Jack Frost. Yep. His son. I needed a way to deliver my milk directly into any house from anywhere in the world. I needed Merry Gear. Merry Gear. Yes, Merry Gear. Merry Gear. My pedal sleigh with the ability to launch gifts from any location. But how would this help you deliver your milk? Snake, you are <laughs> Put the milk in a gift box. Yes, the greatest gift of all. <laughs> Snake, 
It was only my dream to make the world a happier place through milk. Gee, it seems that your dreams have expired. Uh. And I, along with them. Oh my gosh. But don't cry. Overspilled milk. I'll be back again someday. <laughs> I guess there's no use crying. Yeah. Over spilled milk. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Otacon, health. What is it, Snake? It's yeah. Crap. I can't see. I can't breathe. And everything smells like cardboard. Wait, Snake, are you inside of a box? Otacon, there's a sleeping kid in here with a note taped to his back. What's it say? Now I have a polar gun. Oh. <laughs> oh. Looks like the no good either. You found the Holid Eye. The Holid Eye? It's a special eyepiece that's powered by memories of Christmas's past. By filtering out the sad blues and sickly greens of the visual field, but compensating with an amplified red component. Rose tinted glasses. Well, I'm guessing your Christmas memories are unspeakably haunting. Soul crushing, even. Well, when you put it that way. <laughs> In that case, the hollowed eye should overcompensate by amplifying not only red light, but infrared light. Oh well. my goodness. So I'll be able to see it in infrared. That's right. Oh, to another present. Snake, you found the polar gun. A polar, polar gun. gun is an experimental weapon developed by the US government. It fires a small syringe filled with a powerful polarizing serum that gives its target incredible polar bear powers. Operation Intrude N90 was the government's first attempt to infiltrate Santa's workshop in the North Pole. There was just one problem. What was that? It was winter. Each and every one of the polar berets followed their orders and injected <laughs> themselves with the serum. Immediately Instead, fell asleep. Each and every one of them fell into a deep sleep. Oh, gosh. Cold. So, Merry Gear Solid 2, my thoughts on this game. It's hilarious, first off. There's in-jokes, holiday jokes, Metal Gear jokes, and even movie jokes. There was like a Die Hard reference in there. And even as a casual, very casual fan of the old Metal Gear games, I saw, I caught a ton of humor in here. I would have to say, yeah, if you really like stealth, you like the old Metal Gear games, absolutely play this and probably even place the uh, the first one i understand there's a third one coming but as as a stealth game goes it was pretty fun very very fun very reminiscent of the old titles the old metal gear games merry gear solid 2 ghosts of christmas past